right, so the car is clean, it's in the boot, so I'm ready to mask it. We're gonna mask it all up real quick, put the plastic over, and then we'll be ready to paint. Let's do it. Okay, the Porsche is masked up. I didn't cut away the plastic yet, because firstly, I'm gonna cut away just the hood part and uh, seal the new hood, as well as the new bumper. That way we're not gonna get any unwanted overspray on the fenders. This fender is perfectly good, and then this fender is new, but we already sealed it before we put it on. And then the door, we're just blending, so pretty much gotta seal the new parts. And then we can unmask the rest of the car and spray our base coat, clear coat. Blend everything out, and it should come out looking new. Let's not waste any time. Let's get started. like a dark gray sealer so it's going to be similar to this color and we're still going to seal this just because it's a new bumper and the uh, sealer is going to give proper adhesion to our base coat and protect from rock chips. Okay, so we're gonna let that dry for 15 minutes and then we'll be ready to put our base coat. So this is our first coat of base, it's dry, and we're starting to look 
Like we're getting somewhere. So you can still see that it's spotty, not even. And we're gonna need about two more coats. Another medium heavy coat. Then a control coat to lay it all out, and then we'll be ready to clear coat. So yeah, looking good, looking good. So I'm just gonna mix up some more base coat and we'll be ready to continue. By the way, the color coat is C9X. I forgot what it's called, but uh, we'll look it up right now. Porsche and it's called Tief Schwarz. I don't know what that is, but Teeth Schwarz. So it's like a black metallic. And we're using a darker times eight special. Mix up another 12 ounces or so, and we'll be good to go. Okay, we did our two coats plus our control coat over everything. Bumpers ready to go. We blended out on this side, stayed away from the door. As you can see, the tape is yellow, just on the top a little bit, but that's not gonna be noticeable. And same on the passenger side door. We did a nice clean blend and stayed away from the edge of the door. So then that way, we'll have a nice clean transition of our color. So, got my clear coat ready. Let's shoot our two coats and hope for the best. Let's go.
right, so it's the next day. The Porsche is finally painted. It's dry and it's ready to go. It came out super sweet. I'm very happy with it. It's time to get the car out of the booth. But before we do that, let's take a quick look and see how it turned out.